15,000 forint, 15,000, 20,000. Do I see 20? Yes, 25,000, 30,000. Any advance on 30? Yes, 35,000, 40,000, 45,000, 50,000. 60, 70, 80. Sit down. Will no one offer any more for this fine Wiedermeyer table rock? Yes, 90,000, 100, 110,000. Going for 110,000 forints, ladies and gentlemen. Going, going, done. Sold for 110,000 forints. And now we come to lot number 28. A portrait of a gentleman by an unknown artist of the Hungarian school, late 19th century. Uh, this painting, belonging to the Festatich family, formed part of their priceless collection at the Kesthely Castle on the shore of Lake Balaton. Now, the bidding for this painting starts at 40,000 forints. Yes, 40,000? 40, 45,000. What? 50,000? 60,000! 60,000? 80,000! Well, the building is at 80,000, ladies and gentlemen. It's going for 80,000 forints. Going, going, gone. Sold for 80,000 forints to the gentleman in the check jacket. Now, we come to lot number 29. A bronze nude representing the biblical figure Susanna. You belong on medication, you know that, don't you? This garbage isn't worth a cent. Why do you want it anyway? What the hell do you see in this crap? Will you take it now, or would you like to have it sent? I'll take it now. You don't know nothing at all about clocks. The spike it three years ago with me, and now you want to branch off into paintings? 80,000 forests. That's over $1,500. Four weeks pay. Don't you forget that. Bukin Tour Theater, November 1891, Swan Lake, choreographer Marius Blakem, prima ballerina Natalie Horvath. Natalie Horvath.
hol voltál tegnap este? Már mondtam, Katival mentem el. Good evening. Ah, good evening. I heard you were looking for company. Well, uh, actually, uh, that is, uh... Perhaps I've got to the wrong room. Oh, no, no, no. This is the right place. Please, come in. Excuse me. Do you speak English? Yes, I do. Could you translate this for me, please? Yesterday evening, at the Brukentorhe Theater, prima ballerina Natalie Horvath was the victim of a tragic accident. Just before her entrance, she inexplicably fled from the theater and was knocked down and killed by a passing carriage. Do you want me to go on? Yes, please. Choreographer Marius Balakim, who had promised an unusual version of Swan Lake with a new ending, has canceled all performances refuses to see anyone or make any statement about the incident. Is that all? Yes. Thank you. So how did the story end? I'm not sure it has an ending. Jason! Jason! Where the hell have you been? I've been looking for you all morning. I've packed your bags. We have to leave right now. What are you talking about? Your mother. She's in the hospital. Here, take this. What's wrong? She's been hurt. Leave that. I'll, I'll take, take the clock. Uh, how is she? I mean, is it bad? It's not good. We've got to hurry. There's a flight in an hour. Wait a minute. I want to call home. No time right now! How'd you hear about it? They sent a telegram. What did it say? I'll tell you later. To the airport. Hurry. Oh, just don't stand there like a dummy. She's not only your mother, she's my sister, too. Come on, get in. Would you mind telling me what happened? A, a car accident. Car accident, she doesn't even drive. Uh, a friend was driving. Can I see that telegram? I, I must have left it back in the hotel and all that confusion. And you, put your foot on the gas. I told you we're in a hurry. Uh, pull over. I want to make a call. No, drive on. I said pull over. I want to get out. <laughs> <laughs> 